meet the world's first ever Olympic refugee team. The refugee crisis is rampant in the world and especially in Europe. It's really sad when you think about it. People are forced to flee their homelands to take refuge in unknown lands. It's difficult to imagine the pain and suffering they go through. But with the Olympic Committee announcing the inclusion of a refugee Olympic athletes are 018 and Rio 2016, hope was provided to many stateless athletes. Their homes may have been taken away, but their dreams were just provided some brick and mortar. Watch the video and meet the members of the FIST refugee team in history. Yusra Mardini Along with her sister, in September 2015, the then 17-year-old escaped war-torn Syria. They swam in the ice-cold ocean to reach Greece, while pushing a boat full of refugees. From there, they somehow escaped to Germany and settled in Berlin, where she trained and was selected for the ROA team. Papa Mzenga Mzenga was only six when his mother was murdered. He ran to a nearby rainforest, wandering for a week, before being rescued. He was harassed by his coaches, who even locked him and fellow judoka Yolan Mabika also part of our OAN cages when they did not perform. Mabika convinced Papal to escape during the 2013 World Judo Championships when their staff had confiscated their passports and money. He sought political refuge in Brazil and was granted refugee status in September 2014. Yolan Mabika Yolan was separated from her parents at a very young age and took up judo in the children's home. She helped fellow judoka Papal Mzenga escape the clutches of their evil coaches in 2013. Before receiving support from the IOC, she worked as a sweeper and even slept on the streets of Brazil. Post that, she joined a judo school and trained to make it to Rio. James Cheng James' father was a soldier who died in the Second Sudanese Civil War in 1999. Aged 13, to avoid being recruited as a child soldier by the rebels, he escaped to Kenya. He lived in a refugee camp there and ran without shoes before being picked up by the Tagalilaru Peace Foundation, where he trained and was selected for Rio 2016. Yich Biel. Like James, he too fled to Kenya to escape the civil war. He was picked up by the same foundation from the same camp as James. Yich also trained without any shoes or gym. But now he and his team members train under Tagalilaru who is a long-distance world record holder. Paulo Emoton Locoro Back home, he was a cattle herder. The war forced him to flee to the very same Kakuma camp as Yich and James. He was also picked up by Tegla Larup during a scouting session and started training under her in Nairobi. Angelina Nadei Lahulif Angelina was also scouted by Tegla Larup and currently trains under her in Nairobi. She fled her country because of the war and was staying in the Kakuma camp. She hopes that her success as an athlete can help her provide a better life for her parents. Rose Nathaik Lokawanyan Like four of her companions, Rose went through the same pain in Sudan. She fled and found refuge at the Kakuma camp and was also taken to Nairobi to train with Tegla Larup. She used to run through the camp turned home barefoot. Her parents went back home but she decided to stay and pursue her passion. Yona's Kin He escaped his home country due to political turmoil. Yona settled in Luxembourg, where he drives a taxi to make a living. He won many medals in Luxembourg and could have qualified for the Luxembourg team as well, but his status does not allow him to do so. He was then selected for the ROA team. Rami Innes When war was tearing his hometown apart, Rami fled to Turkey. From there, he used tree branches as makeshift oars for a dingy and reached Greece and eventually found refuge in Belgium. His uncle inspired him to become a swimmer, 